I'm back with Josh. So, um, hey, we, we just pulled up to the ramp. We're about to get out. Uh, we met up. I'm, I ran up to Knoxville. We're metting up, getting in a river. How many miles are we doing, Josh? Oh, man, it's probably... We're doing a little extra than we normally... Oh, we've we've done this... 12 miles? Yeah, we've, we've done most of this float several times, and the last time I caught some really good smallmouth. It's middle of October. It was like in the 30s this morning, and uh, I think the, like, the smallmouth are going to be eaten. But we're going to cover a lot of miles, so a lot of chance to catch some good fish. So let's get... Uh, I, and I brought the bigger kayak. He brought his bigger kayak. Uh, cause this is a little bit bigger water and the water is up. I'm excited to get in here. Just want to show you. Yeah, you. that's not a bad fish. I threw, no, I threw a butt bait, 20, 30 cast down through there. I picked up a plate of jig, second cast. So. Well, I'm just getting in the water. Josh already got a fish. I gotta adjust my camera. I feel like it's too low in the back. There's one. Hey, we got one. Had been going too far. A little smally. I think I had a hit just back there from another one. Little one. I had a good one following up. It just like hit it right at the kayak. Oh yeah. I, I've definitely had two or three hits. Like, but they feel like smaller fish. I've I, throwing. Spinner bait. I've caught one, but it was like a 11, 10, 11 incher. Oh, I got a follower, but I had grass on it and he wouldn't eat it. I had a big old piece of grass on it. Yeah, I know. I was like, we're moving along. Oh, there we go. Hey. Right on the bank. Oh my god. Hey, hey. Oh! He had a tag in him. Oh, you threw it back. Oh, I, I couldn't I couldn't catch it because it was slipping out of my hands and oh. then I saw it had a tag. That's a hundred dollars. Man, I didn't see it at first. Oh that's no. crazy. I've never caught a tag fish. I saw it as it was falling in the water. That's what happened to me that day. I should have took I should have just took my chance. I was like, well, I'll just let him fall back in there. All right, well, Josh has already got three fish. That's my second one in 30 minutes. And I had a, it definitely had a tag in it. Man, that was, um, <laughs> oh, your rod about hit. Man, I wish I'd, I wish I'd have hung on to it a little bit. I was just like, ah, let him just fall back in there. He was like, probably, it wasn't real big. I expect the tag to be like a bigger one, but he's like 13, 14 inches, maybe. There's another one. That was like three casts in between. No tag on that one. We'll go ahead and put it back in there. I'm checking every one of them really good. Yeah, it does. Cast up it. Oh, right there. Uh, oh, had a hit and my rod's gonna make it. Uh. Almost, almost lost him. Right on that bank. Oh, that's a good one. Oh, I lost a good one. Yeah, he was nice. He was nice. He broke my spinner blade. Man, broke my spinner blade. I should have known. I, I had that and wore out from fishing in Pennsylvania and I should have replaced it. They can only take so much like bending and stuff. That was a big small mouth and I lost it. Man. That's the only bad thing about spinner blades. You use them a lot and I do. I use them a lot. They will break. They're gonna break over time. Just metal. Well, we're just having a hard start this morning left had a tag fish let it go back in hooked a big one broke this i thought it came unhooked i'm like how did he come unhooked I actually broke this the spinner blade 
But you know what? We're going back with another one. And um, those fish are biting. They're really close to the bank. So, like, all, already you can tell they're hanging on the bank really tight. Josh was saying it's gonna be on. I think it is. These fish are active. Get a big one here. Hopefully land a good one here in a minute. Wow. How did that thing get on there? Oh yeah. Oh wow, that's a good one. That's a big one. That's a big one. Josh! Almost in the neck. Oh, that's a nice one. I went through this shallow area. I threw out in the middle. I've been making some casts out in the middle because I know there's like shoals out here. Oh man, how'd this thing get all now that thing's all connected on there. That's a long, that's back to my, <laughs> in Susquehanna, I was catching those big old fat ones. I'm back to these long Tennessee skinny river fish. Oh yeah, he's a 17 and a half. All right, 17 and a half. Good long skinny smallmouth. That's how we, that's how we grow them down here. Cove, right where he should be, though. Right where he should be. <laughs> oh my goodness! They are loaded up on this thing. Oh, was that a big one or was that a carp that went below me? Well, they are hitting pretty good. I don't even know, was that, I think eight or ninth fish already? Maybe 10, I don't even know how many I've got. It's already a good day when I've, you ain't been going, but maybe an hour and I already got that many. I'm just working that bank, but every every fish has been really close to the bank. If I don't get my cast, um, except for that one I was out in the middle, which was the biggest one. Oh, oh, what? I got a hit and I was just letting my spinnerbait sit. Man, they are up in here. Oh, there, oh, I just saw it. I got another hit. I watched them come out. All right. This is crazy. There's a lot of them down here. Oh, yeah, that's a big one. Oh, There's a good one. I watched them come get it. Come here. Yeah. I need a pitch. Oh, While you're here, let me get a picture of this one. This guy was thicker. Oh, he's thick. That's a nice one. Oh, we're gonna catch way bigger than that today, though. Quit saying that. It's gonna happen. Don't, no. Yeah, it is. Be happy, you, you do this every time. <laughs> You've you already caught like what, five or six? I've caught 10 fish. 10? And this is my second one over 17. See, there you go. Look how his weird his tail is. It's, his tail is making it a... Uh, Longer? Inch longer. He said just I thought you was fishing an online tournament. I am. I was an 18 incher that went back in. That was 18 inches just then? Yeah, he was over 18 because his tail was wow. real long. It was like a 17 with an extra long tail. Crazy. Anyhow. You didn't get a picture of it? Not on the board. Dang. Uh it's kind of hard to do it in this current and we got some photos and then I was trying to get it on the board. But that was a really nice fish. Another one on the spinnerbait. I'm not liking this net. I went and bought this net, and I don't like it. It's too shallow. 
I gotta go get a, a good net. Dude. Where is it at? Up there. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I told you. First 20 of the day. Up where? Up in the creek? Yeah, right yeah. there. She hit a bladed jig. I saw her. I was like, oh, it's a good, it's a big, because I saw, I mean, she was so big, I just watched her. There we go, guys. 20 incher, first one of the day. I told John. We was going to catch a 20, so that's the first one. I don't know. All right, let's go down there and catch more fish, take a break here. Well, we're only like three, four, four miles in, maybe. I mean, technically, like if like we normally float, like Cliff Road, we're just starting. There's a good one. That's a good one. You're not a, you're not a 20, so he's nice. Ah, dude, they're all good. They are munching today. Dude, that's not bad. They are munching. That's awesome. They are. I was going to let you fish it. Now that you got one, I'm yeah, going to make a couple casts. These guys are long and skinny. Whoa, whoa. I'm in a tree. Got to pay attention where you're going. This is a 15 and a quarter. So I'm back. I just watched Josh. Or I, I came in the corner and Josh had a 20 incher. And uh, it was a beautiful fish. I'd like to get one. That's kind of the goal whenever you fish these river, especially this river. Like, there's a lot of 20s in there. That's the goal. And that's a uh, trophy size, a 20 incher. Is there's a little bit? Oh man, there was a big one down there. I just saw a big one swim off. There was a lot of logs. I, I didn't get a single fish off logs. And I fished, you know, that's three full days of fishing basically. And I, I did a lot of cast, a lot of fishing. Holy cow. That's a 21. That's a giant. I'll be able to... Josh just kind of giant. Ah, that's kind of where you get a little aggravated. You're like, okay, okay. Enough fun for him. Let me have one of those. Dude, that fish is like... Oh my! Biggin. Did we just double up on Biggin? Not as big as yours, but he's big. Biggin. It ain't Josh's biggin, but we just doubled up on some nice river smallies. Nice. All right. That's, <laughs> I'm gonna get caught in the tree over here. Oh, he threw the spinnerbait out. Oh. All right, that's probably a 16 incher. We're gonna throw him back because Josh has got one that makes this one look tiny. Let's get us to look at his. We'll take a picture and get a video of his over here. Four, nine, three. Dude, that's that is a, that's basically a five pounder. Right? This is just four nine three. Yeah. She hit five and then went back down to four nine three. Twenty one and three quarters. Oh my goodness, that is so long. This right here is why you come over here to these rivers. Uh, felt coming down through there, throwing that bladed jig, and I didn't even feel her hit it. I just felt slack. There was nothing there. Reeled, felt the pressure, set the hook, and uh, yeah, I knew instantly that that was a giant. The thing is, though, you can catch, like, a day like this, like, the big ones are eating. That's what's crazy. It's like, you're, you're, the big ones are there. Oh, my goodness. All right, I got a mission now is got to catch a big one. That was crazy. That was a super big river fish. Just insane. Good, another hit. <laughs> oh, there's a log. That's right? a slug. Yeah, it's kind of weird. But... Another hit. Good. I probably had, look at these. I probably had 10 or 15 of these guys hit down through here. Unless you want to go do it first. I'll let you. Uh, no, nah, go ahead. I'll just keep going down this bank. You'll probably go catch another one. <laughs> That's a fat little dude. Man. I'm starting to get aggravated with these little guys. Usually it's awesome, but now I'm like really focused on getting a big one. Oh, I'm getting some current here. Let me get turned around. Oh my goodness! 
<laughs> Stop eating fish. <laughs> There's my sign. That's my sign right there. I just saw Eagle go by. Getting a giant. It's coming. It's coming. It's coming. I feel it. And no way. Dude, look at this large mouth. <laughs> like a eagle goes by, get a large mouth. Don't get a little get a little large mouth out of here. About a 15 inch large mouth. Next cast. The, the bite is ridiculous right now. About a 12 inch smallie. I'm just trying to get these fish back off here so I can get a cast back out as fast as I can. Oh my. <laughs> these guys are getting hooked and I ain't even trying to hook them. That one got hooked. Wow, they're dark. Yeah, they're... Really dark one there. <laughs> Man, some days you just don't realize how many fish are in the river. Well, it's two o'clock. We've covered uh, quite a bit of water. I sit here, take a quick little break, eat a little bit of snacks. Um, been an incredible day fishing. I've caught a bunch of fish, over 20 fish, I'd say. A lot of little ones. I had a lot of hits that have like just hit and come off. So the fish that has, has been very aggressive. I'm looking for that big one. Josh has got those two big ones. It was crazy because that one, I I caught a fish. He kind of went around in front of me. And we were fishing this ledge, kind of like just alternating. And then he throws in there and catches that one that was almost five pounds. And about, uh, uh, since then, we haven't caught any big ones yet. The water is working its way down from uh, the dam way upstream. So it's, it's lowering, but it could, it could catch back up, start raising again, I don't know. But the fish are still biting. And we got several more places to go where we can still catch some big ones. It was a really cold start, but I'm gonna shed a little layer. This is an Ashigan brand. And it's like the official brand of smallmouth. I got this from Josh. I fished with him uh, up in Pennsylvania. And uh, he also has a Smalley Talk podcast. Some of y'all might know that. So definitely got some cool designs and they're big smallmouth guys, but I got to shed a layer. All right, good little break. We're going to get right back into it. And there's some good sections right through here. Okay. Oh, little one. <laughs> <laughs> Boom, right back on them. <laughs> this is the most fish I've ever caught here. Probably the most fish I've ever caught while fishing with you. Like name a day where we caught more fish. What? Hey. Let's video it. So I'm going to cut this tag off and uh, call this. It's got a number on it. And, and check Josh's channel to find out what happens next.
because he got this his third 20 incher i'm not going to ruin his video he's had an incredible day is this josh again it is yeah i, I recognize yeah. yours too we actually had two of them today. My buddy John, uh, Creek Fisher Adventures, he had one on earlier. He accidentally l dropped it in the water as a smaller one, but. I saw the tag as I was letting it go. <laughs> so I've caught a 21 and three quarters today. I've caught a 20 and then this one's 20 and a half, the tag one, so it's really good over here today. Holy smokes. Yeah. Oh my! <laughs> oh! I just lost a jump! <laughs> oh my goodness! Josh was right. I threw the blade jig. I just hooked a monster and it came off. I wish I had it on my other rod. I didn't have the right setup. I feel like I don't know. I don't know why it came off. But he did. But I watched that fish come out. He like really came out and ate it. That was at least an 18-incher. Just, oh my goodness. I'm, I'm having an awesome day, but I'm like struggling at the same time. I don't know what is going on. Oh. That's not bad. Oh, it's been a minute since I had a decent one. Not a 20, but. Oh. Goodness, it's strong. Well, you got one on the cheddar bait. 514, 15. Am I positive or negative? Cross your toe. Stay on, stay on, stay on. That's a good one. That's a really good fish. Stay on. Stay on. Stay on, stay on, stay on. Is he on there? Oh! I lost my net and the fish. No! 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 Get the fishing, get the fishing. That was such a mess. I, I, I hit the bell. I lost my net, but I landed the fish. Is it a 20? If not, it's a really nice fish. Oh man, we are really close to the end here. That guy was not coming off. My net is down at the bottom somewhere. I didn't like that net anyways. All right, let's see how long he is. I think he's gonna be about 18. Pretty nice fish. And where's your mouth? He is 17. 17 and a quarter. Not bad. 17 and a quarter in the day off. My uh, line's all messed up on my spinnerbait, so uh, we're gonna throw something else on there. Pretty good fish. We are back. Oh my goodness, the fishing was, this is the best I've ever had on this river. I've caught bigger fish, but I lost a couple of really good ones. Josh had absolutely incredible, like I probably caught more fish than him, but he caught like three just uh, giant ones. And uh, it was awesome just to see that. I, we've come out here before and really struggled, you know, certain times on this river, but I think it really is, it's the fall. The temperature's dropping, the fish started eating. Um, I was, we were talking about, I bet I had 75 at least hits and probably what landed at least 30 of those fish probably had more hits than that. There were so many fish that were just coming out and wham hitting at it. But dude, we, we probably spent eight hours out there 
and uh, it was a well spent eight hours fish biting the whole way. Yeah, I, I try not to put too much of what Josh's was because I want him to share, like show what he had. Um, I I had an amazing day and was still frustrated because when you watch somebody else catch big fish, you like you just you just really want to get one. But no, I'm, I, I can't complain. It was too good. I wish I hadn't thrown that tag fish back in. I love the land of 20, but all in all, it was an insane day. Uh, you got time to go get some food? Let's do it. All right, we're going to go eat and um, wrap it up. But man, awesome, awesome day. If you want to see what he did, go check out his channel.